methods of linear measurements approximate using chain or tape by optical means and using electro -dist electromagnetic distance measurement instruments. Approximate methods are pacing, passometer, pedometer, odometer, speedometer. Pacing is counting the number of steps covered by us during a journey multiplied by the dist distance of one step will give the total length of the distance. Passometer is an instrument that counts the number of steps carried by us. Pedometer when we feed the st our step distance and zero it will give direct distance traveled by us. Odometer is an instrument that counts the number of rotations covered by a wheel with multiplying the distance. Speedometer is an instrument generally fixed in our automobiles that will give the approximate distance covered by us in a particular journey. Our step distance can be arrived by covering a known distance and counting number of steps. Chains of 20 meter or 30 meters with 100 links are available. Steel band tapes of cloth, steel, metal and envir are there. Steel band is similar to tape with graduations and without case. Cloth, cloth tapes are less durable, steel tapes are widely used. Invar tape will have a least variations due to temperature variations. It is made up of invar. Chains of 20 meters are generally used. These are called Gunter's chain. It will have a 66 feet that is approximately 20 meters and having 100 links. Each link will have 20 centimeters. Optical measuring instruments are theodolite tachometer. Theodolite is used for measuring horizontal and vertical angles. Tachometers, through tachometers, we can directly measure distance with uh, staff reading. Total stations are having all features of measuring instruments. EDMs are for used for less distances. Global position stations. Instruments used in chaining, arrows, pegs, ranging rods and ranging poles, offset rods, lads, weights, plumb bobs, line rangers. Arrows are fixed on a survey line after every chain length or tape length. Pegs are somewhat standard survey stations where wooden pegs will be fixed. Ranging rods are used for making a straight line where line, line length is more than a chain or tape. Offset rods are used for fixing offsets or perpendicular lines. Laths are wooden, wooden sticks painted with white on the top and generally used in measuring depression areas. Plumb bobs are used for making ranging rods vertical and transferring the instrument position from the instrument height to ground. Whites are locally available sticks used for surveying purpose. Line rangers are used to locate point on a line 
अन्य सर्वे लाइन दिस विल हेल्प द लेस नंबर ऑफ पीपल फॉर कैरिंग आउट द सर्वेइंग ऑफसेट रॉड्स आल्सो यूज्ड फॉर मेकिंग ऑफसेट लाइंस क्रॉस टॉप्स ऑफ वुडन और मेटालिक विथ क्रॉस हेयर्स विल बी यूज्ड फॉर सेटिंग ऑफ ऑफसेट और परपेंडिकुलर लाइंस वुडन क्रॉस टॉप्स आर हैविंग स्लिट्स ऑन द both directions with 90 degrees angles locating intermediate points and survey line is known as ranging if ranging is not proper the measured distance will be more than the actual distance if all points are visible from a to d direct ranging can be done by placing a ranging rod in between stations at a tape length or indirect ranging will be done when a and d are not visible from one place to another in that case in between approximate points at b and c are placed such that abc or bcd are visible from वन एंड टू अदर एंड आफ्टर दट फ्रॉम द अदर एंड दट पॉइंट आर एडजस्टेड अब्सटल इन चेनिंग अब्सटल इन चेनिंग अब्सटल इन रेजिंग अब्सटल इन रेजिंग एंड चेनिंग वेन अब्सटल आर देर इन चेनिंग रेक्टांगल आर कंस्ट्रक्टेड अट अब्सट्रक्ष बिफोर अब्सट्रक्षन एंड आफ्टर अब्सट्रक्षन पर्पंडिकुलेंस आर रेक्टेड एंड फ्रॉम देर रईट ऐंगल इज मेड एंड सो दट बीसी डिस्टेंस इज ईक्वल टू बी डाशी डैश आर रईट ऐंगल ट्रयांगल हेज टू बी कंस्ट्रक्टेड बिफोर एंड आफ्टर अब्सट्रक्षन if the obstruction is there for chaining and ranging then we have to construct rectangles by erecting perpendiculars at a b c d and extend the lines away from the obstacle and f g can be measured In through in the, uh, you can construct a right angle triangle or a iso isosceles uh, tri triangle and uh, make a perpendicular lines before the obstacles on both sides suitability of chain survey area to be surveyed is comparatively small ground is fairly level area is open and details to be filled are simple and less land surveys are generally carried out with chain survey main station these are stations at the beginning or at the end of lines forming main skeleton subsidiary are tie stations these are stations selected on main lines to run auxiliary or secondary lines for purpose of locating interior details base line it is the most important line and is the longest 
usually it is the line plotted first and then framework of triangles are built on it detail lines if important objects are far away from the main line the offsets are too long resulting into inaccurate and taking more time for measurements in such cases the secondary lines are run by selecting secondary stations on the main line check lines these are the lines connecting main station and substation on opposite side are the lines connecting substations on the sides of main lines the purpose of measuring such lines is to check the accuracy of the with which main stations are located selection of survey station the survey station should be visible from more stations main line should run on level ground all triangles should be well conditioned main network should have as few lines as possible main triangle should have at least one check line obstacle to ranging and chaining should be avoided large triangle should pass as close to boundary trespassing and frequent crossing should be avoided offsets lateral measurements to main survey lines to locate objects or offsets offsets may be perpendicular or oblique perpendicular offsets can be done by swinging or cross tap using optical prism or square Offsets may be also constructed with uh, arcing. Errors in chain surveying, personal errors, wrong reading, wrong recording, reading from wrong end of the chain. These are uh, of uh, serious errors and uh, care should be taken uh, to avoid uh, such errors. Wrong reading means uh, instead of reading 18.15, the person uh, reads as uh, 13.15. Wrong recording means person tells 18.16, recording person will record 8.16. Errors in chain surveying, compensating errors, Inco incorrect marking of the end of weight chain, fractional part of chain may not be correct, though total length is correct, graduation tape may not be exactly same throughout, if the method of stepping while measuring slope in ground, plum may be used. These are uh, compensate errors in sensor and cumulative errors. Bad ranging, bad uh, straightening, erroneous length of chain, temperature variation, variation in applied pull, non horizontal sagging chain. Due to bad ranging, uh, more length will come. Ba due to bad straightening also ba more length will come uh, due to erroneous length of chain uh, positive or uh, negative temperature uh, correction for chain length correct length of chain is uh, 30.12 designated uh, length is 30 meters uh, correction applied is 0.12 in that case uh, measured length will be 3000 meters uh, correct length uh, must be 3012 after applying a correction. Correction for a pull. Chain will be designed for some standard pull. Whereas applied pull at the site may be different. If less pull is applied, more distance will come if uh, more pull is applied uh, less uh, distance will come
correction for temperature taper chain may be designed for standard temperature while at site during winters less temperature will be there during summers more temperature will be there the necessary correction has to be applied while taking measurement and field temperature while measuring hilly areas necessary slope corrections are to be applied by taking a difference of level or angle of the slope otherwise measured distance will be more than actual distance due to self weight of chain or tape it will sag at the center so it will give less distance so we have to apply sag correction to ascertain the correct distance Indian standard 962 specifies the specific symbols and colors to to show on the maps and plans for buildings light gray color is used field book is maintained similar to the plan of the survey survey field